Hey guys, my name is Trina. Today's video, I'm going to be reviewing and demoing, and it's going to be like a first impression on the new Make a Revolution Seal and Divine Full Coverage Foundation. If this is your first time here and you want to learn more about this foundation and other makeup videos then click subscribe and notification bell so you don't miss any new videos this foundation comes in 24 shades and it's very affordable it only costs 12 dollars okay so it claims i'm gonna read from my phone what it claims i'm on the website and it claims it is creamy, it is oil free, and it's suitable for every skin types. And it's long lasting, and it's a demi matte finish, and it's no waxy. It has no waxy stuff, meaning like it doesn't like the, the foundation doesn't like slide off your face throughout the day. And it can be weird using a lot of layers. So if you want to use two or three layers of this foundation you can it said it's not a problem it won't make your face look cakey that's what i read and then it says it, it it blends out to wrap up the coverage of the real skin finish that diffuses blemishes and uneven skin tones which is great and another thing about this foundation it is vegan cruelty free paraben free and oil free okay so i'm gonna use one side with a primer and the other side with no primer because i want to see how it looks like without a primer and with a primer so i'm gonna use the smashbox photo finish foundation primer on this side and then this side is gonna be no foundation no foundation primer whatsoever but on this side i'm gonna use a brush and then on this side i'm gonna use a beauty blender sponge okay so let's start priming a little bit over in this side of the face And then I'm going to use a beauty blender on this side. So, start by So I like it. It is definitely a demi matte finish and I love the matteness of it. I love it and it does make my skin to be so flawless. I love it. And this is the shade. I forgot to tell you the shade of this. This is F10, the Makeup Revolution and I love it. This is definitely like the perfect match for it and the formula is very liquidy so it's like a lightweight foundation but it's very like demi matte and it does leave your face looking so natural and i love it this is with the with a primer now i'm gonna apply this side with uh, a primer with some strokes and 
and I'm using this Real Techniques Oval Foundation Brush. Oh wow, I really like how it looks like with the brush. Looks so nice. Do you guys see this? I'm up close, so this is the side, like I said with primer without primer with a sponge with a brush so a sponge brush which one do you guys think which one do you guys like do you like it with a sponge or with a brush because this is sponge and this is brush and this is with primer and this is without primer so tell me what you guys think which one you guys think in the comment below which one looks better for you but personally for me, I think this side looks better without no primer, but with a brush, it looks so good. Look at this. I love this side. And I love the way how it like makes my skin look so flawless. It looks, my skin looks so natural. Like, the coverage is full coverage, yeah, but it's not like super, super full coverage. Like, it's up to the point that it's like super cakey on your face. No, but it gives like a natural look. Like, I love it. And another thing about this product, it is very creamy, 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 creamy. I love it so much. It is a super creamy foundation, lightweight, demi matte. Like, uh, another thing I forgot to tell you is that when I was, like, with the wand applying it on my face, it, like, instantly got dried up fast. I definitely had to, like, blend it up quick because since it was a demi matte, it matte, like, it dried up quick. Like, other foundations that I tried, like, once you put on a liquid foundation, like, the liquid stays on your face, but it doesn't stay matte. Like, as soon as I put this, it turned matte, and I just had to blend it out. Then I also had to reapply it because it's like the foundation just stayed in one place. But when I use a liquid foundation, it just stays wet, but this one stayed like when I applied it, it got dried real quickly. So I honestly love it and it's a very super very super affordable foundation for just $12 and I absolutely love it and I give this product a thumbs up thanks for Makeup Revolution thank you Makeup Revolution for creating this awesome foundation it is great I am also in love with your concealer it is the best concealer ever and I absolutely love okay so this is how it looks with makeup looks so pretty right So I just add some highlighter, some bronzer, I did a little eye makeup, eyeliner, and a little like a wine color liquid lipstick. So overall, I just really love this foundation. It is so good and it's so amazing. And I love the fact that it comes in 24 shades. So 
So nobody doesn't have to be scared that, oh, I hope they have my shade. I hope they have my shade. I don't, I'm tired of mixing shades to get my right color. No, no, no. You will definitely find your color. Again, 24 shades of this foundation and it only costs $12, which is great. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this foundation review and demo of the Makeup Revolution Conceal and Dry Full Covers Foundation. I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you like this video, please give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in my next video.